problem number five, the density of copper is 8.89 gram per cubic centimeter and the resistivity is 1.724 raised to negative 6 ohm centimeter. Determine length in meter and the resistance of a 12 kilogram copper, the cross sectional area of which is 2.09 mm square square millimeter. So, so puna natin yung given. The density of copper, so capital na lang letter D. Usually kasi ang symbol natin sa density is rho, pero kasi mag, may binibili din na rin sa CVT, baka magparehas tayo para hindi tayo mag itong capital letter D na lang for density. 8.89 gram per cubic centimeter. Okay? And then, resistivity is given also, which is 1.724 times 10. Okay, so negative 6 um, centimeter. And upon given, um, we can select the ating mass, which is 12 okay, kilogram. And then, in cross sectional area, okay, binigay na yung area, which is 2.09 mm square or square millimeter. Ayan. Okay. Siguro dito ko na nalalagay yung mass. Mass. 12 kilogram. Okay. Ipit natin para. Mass. 12 kilogram. Tapos yung ating area. Which is 2.09. And m square a para mas save natin ang space. Okay. And yung ating yeah, para mas save natin yung mga space. Equals 1.724 times 10 base negative 6 ohm centimeter. Ayan. Okay. So, ang tinatanong, ang required ay length in meter so, that is letter A. And then, yung pangalawa is yung ating resistance. Okay. So, may given na area. Basically, ang gagawin natin is R is equal to may given na resistivity, length, length, given, hindi. Unknown siya. Okay. And area. Okay, we can use the equation of resistance in terms of resistivity that R is equal to L over A. Okay, so meron tayong resistivity, check. Area, check. Okay, kasi yung area. Uh, ito naka ohm centimeter, ito naka mm square. Convert lang naman natin yan. Kailangan natin yung length, which is required sa letter A. So, kailangan talaga natin makuha yung length. Pero paano natin makuha yung length? Ano ba yung mga ibang given? So, check natin mga given na. Ayan, alam na natin kung saan natin gagabit yan. Ang given is density at saka yung mass. Okay, paano natin uh, gagamit yung density and mass? Related ba siya sa length? Okay. Ang definition kasi ng density is mass over volume. Tama? Okay. So, meron tayong density, meron tayong mass. Ano naman ang relation ng volume sa length? Ang volume kasi for a uniform uh, or yung mga regular, ano natin, regular object natin. Bawa yung mga cylindrical, okay. Yung copper kasi diretso yan, eh. uniform siya. Okay, kukunin mo lang yung base niya, which is the area ng base. Actually, yun yung cross-sectional area, okay, uniform, uh, cross-sectional area, times the height. Pero in our case, dahil where ang pinag-uusapan natin, yung volume natin, pwedeng, the area, cross-sectional area, multiplied by the length. Tama? So, kung nakuha na natin yung volume, meron tayong area. Therefore, length is volume over area. So, this is our working equation. Okay? We can get length in terms of the given density and mass by getting the volume. Kapag nakuha na natin yung length, ang mangyayari, substitute na natin sa equation natin na resistive resistance in terms of so, let's say this is A, this is B, resistance in terms of resistivity. So, start na natin kunin yung length. Okay, so length is volume over area, pero bago yun, kunin muna natin yung volume. Volume 
okay so for like ayan mo nalang magagay tayong notation para hindi magulo ayan so a for length okay so ang volume is kaya mo na natin makuha yung volume okay volume lalagay ko na lang dito that is mass over density. Okay? Mass over density. Ayan. Ipagpalitan na lang natin ng sila ng pwesto. Mass over density. Okay. So, volume is... Kaya kinukumpleto kong VOL kasi hindi pwedeng V. Ma, baka malito tayo sa uh, voltage ng ating uh, symbol. Okay. Mass. Ang mass natin is mass, 12 kg, ang density is 8.89 gram per centimeter, cubic centimeter. So, convert na natin yung kilogram. Okay, sa gram. Dito na lang natin i-convert. So, kailangan natin convert yan. Times, okay. For 1 kilogram, for every 1 kilogram, there is 1,000 grams. So, that is 12,000 grams. Ayan. Huwag na tayo mag-convert. Huwag na dito sa ating uh, equation mismo. So, 12,000 grams divided by mass over density kasi density is 8.89 gram per cubic centimeter. I cubic, I mean, cube per cubic centimeter. Tama. Tapos, unit analysis cancel out, tas akit itong uh, centimeter sa taas. So, volume is equal to, as in calculator, 1349 Okay, cubic centimeter. Okay, 1349.83 cubic centimeter. And then, kailangan natin yung length. Ayun. Length is volume over area. Ang area natin ay naka mm square. So, pwede natin i-convert yan in terms of centimeter din kasi naka cm tayo. So, for every 1 cm, meron tayo 100, 100, ay, I mean 10, 10 mm. Pero naka-square, kailangan mo rin square yan. So, para, uh, sa pagko-convert, no? Pag naka-square ito, kailangan yung square para ma-cancel ma out. Para ma-cancel out ito at saka yun. At ang unit mo pa rin ay in area. Okay, square centimeter siya. 0. Point, 0. Point 0. 0.0209 square centimeter. Okay. So, gagawin natin siya dito. So, length the volume is 1349.83 centimeter raised to 3 over the area 0. 0.0209 cm square. Cancel out yung sa baba, ang matitira isang cm na lang, which is a unit of length. Length is 64585. 64585.1675. Okay, centimeter. Ang kailangan, length in meters. So, times uli, conversion factor. For every 1 meter, there is 100 centimeter. So, cancel out, cancel out. So, the length in meter is 645, 645.8517 meters. Ayan, yun yung required. So, nga in meters. Yan yung sa letter A natin. How about letter B? Okay. For R. For the resistance. Okay, for the resistance, ito na yung gagamitin natin. From A. So, R is equal to rho. Okay, L over A. R is equal to rho. Rho is 1.724 times 10 raised to negative 6 ohm centimeter times the length 
the length should be in kasi centimeter ito dapat centimeter. So, gamitin natin yung 645.85.1675 centimeter. Divided by the area, naka cm na rin. 0 0.0209 centimeter square. Unit analysis. Cancel out. Uh, unit analysis. Okay, ito. Ito cancel out. Okay, may matira pang isang centimeter. Cancel out dahil ito. Ang matitira ay ox. So, R. R is equivalent to 5.32 ops. Okay. So, let's